to my channel. I'm Davy Killian, and today I am sharing with you two chia pudding recipes. The first one is a chocolate peanut butter recipe, and the second is a vanilla chia pudding recipe. So stay tuned if you want to see a healthy, delicious breakfast option or dessert option. In my first little mason jar, I'm going to add half, about a fourth a cup into the bottom of chia. Then I'm gonna take some vanilla almond milk, and that's about a third a cup. And I'm gonna grab a spoon and stir that in. And here comes the fun part. So I'm going to take some dark chocolate cacao powder. And I'm going to put about, I'd say that's a teaspoon or a little bit more. I am extremely bad at measuring. And then I'm gonna use some PB2. And I will probably take another teaspoon of that and dump all that in and gently blend that together. Get all the powder blended in. Same thing with my chia, and then I'm just going to dump in about a teaspoon of vanilla and get all that blended. And if you want, you can add some sweetener. I prefer mine not to be, because I will add that um, when I eat it in the morning. So there that one is. And this is pretty thick. I like it really thick. You can thin it out by adding more milk if you want, add water. You can kind of just substitute it to make it how you want. Here they are, and I am going to add a few chocolate chips onto my chocolate pudding. Add some raw honey. Just a little drizzle there. And then on my vanilla, I am actually going to add some cinnamon. Just some sprinkle. Put a little honey on that. And feel free to top them with fresh fruit. A banana would be wonderful in the chocolate or vanilla. But there you have it. A simple vanilla and chocolate chia pudding recipe. All right, now it's time for the taste test. Here's the vanilla. Mm, so good. I just love the texture of the chia and the chocolate. Probably my favorite. Mm -hmm. So good, so easy, and healthy and nutritious. So definitely give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next one. Hey, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. So definitely give it a thumbs up if you enjoy cooking and recipe videos. And don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button if you are new to my channel as well. And I hope you have a blessed and wonderful day, and I will talk with you in my next video. Bye.